Hello happy people, Hamza here and welcome back to the channel. Now in this video, I want to show you how you can white label your Astra theme like this one here. This is an Astra theme, so I simply white labeled it and also how you can white label your Astra Pro add-on, which is the plugin and also the Astra starter site plugin. Let's get started and see how we go around this. So now this is how it looks like. So first of all, if you want to white label your Astra Pro plugins and a theme, you should get Astra Pro, the version of Astra, which is an extension of the Astra free theme. And when you come over here to appearance, you come to Astra options, you come and have these options over here. And here you will be in position to enable or to go to the setting options of the white label option, which is down over here and it will bring you over to this page over here whereby you can enter your agency details the astra theme branding and what you want to replace it with this is the before which is this astra and then the after is this one over here of course also the screenshot over here or the image thumbnail is what you choose for your agency or for your brand that you're working for and then when you go to the plugin section before it looks like this Astra Pro, Astra Starter Sites. And over here you have your brand and also the other version. Of course here you can switch the names to what you really want. So what we need to do is simply come back here to the white label option, open it in a new tab and we'll hop over this here. And you simply have to enter in your details over here. I've already fitted it in here. Uh, the description like most stable theme or I can just come over here to the theme description, which I've already opened up here. Theme details right here, copy this. I've already done this, so I can simply update over here, or I can simply change the names and just put anything else. Then the screenshot, this screenshot is the one here, but I can also go back to the media library, and then I can even choose another screenshot that I want to use, uh, let me say this one over here, simply open it up and I get the image URL, close that up, come back here to our white labels option, I paste the new URL and in here I can add another description for the Astra Pro branding and this is actually the extension of the Astra theme which is a plugin that we updated which is over here astra pro then over here you can get this text and then you can describe it here you can customize it to what you want and then the astra pro starter sites or the bundle that you install which is also a third party you can also simply add over here the description you come over here starter sites you know simply paste this over here and you can simply change that to um, pro sites and there you are good to go now once you are done you simply enable white label and then here it says you are about to enable the white label this will remove the white label settings and if you want to access the white label settings in future simply deactivate the astral pro plugin and activate it again so you simply save it here once the update is done, then you'll simply come back here to your installed plugins and of course you'll see that everything has updated and uh, it has the names that you have assigned and when you also come to the themes, of course you also have your theme uh, changed to the theme name that you had chosen. Maybe the other thing we can try to fix, I see this image here, the thumbnail hasn't updated. I can simply come back here to our sites or the pro options come to the white label option here, the settings. And uh, here I can come and still make changes to our image by probably getting another image URL. Let me get this guy over here. I get this image, copy the image URL, come back over here and then we update our thumbnail. Okay, now simply enable then I have saved now. When now I open up my themes and appearance, boom, you realize that now our thumbnail has changed all over. In a nutshell, that's how you can white label your theme or how you can white label your Astra theme. And of course you should have the Astra Pro 
version or extension so that you are in position to have the option to white label your theme if you have any questions comments please let me know down in the comment box below and in case you're new to the channel please give it a subscribe and a like thank you so much for watching see you in the next video goodbye